One of my subscribers asked me to help with the bringing back animation from Cascadeur back to Rigify. So you ask me, I've got you covered. So yeah, and we are good to go. So retarget animation, all the bone uh, selected. Yeah, and press retarget animation and uh, and yeah. <laughs> yes. Uh, I tried, I tried, I really tried this Rococo, tried to to find a solution for free to retarget animation, but no, just no, it doesn't work normally, and anyway, it doesn't have uh, IK support for retargeting, so it's Rococo. We wanna bring our Cascador animation to, to the Rigify rig. A pretty rough animation, but anyway. So, uh, to do this, we need a paid add-on called Afterik Pro. It's amazing add-on. Really, it's must-have add-on and Rococo doesn't work at all. So, I think it's the only way to do it. And by the way, uh, Afterik Pro allows you to retarget IK uh, legs and arms. Uh, I will skip the part then installing add-on and all this stuff. I I hope you know the basic. So let's go to uh, our rig. To do this, yeah, let's remove everything. Uh, we need to select our rig. Ah, uh, yeah, our rig and like source rig. Press I dropped for our cascade rig. And if you if you don't know how to export the FBX animation from Cascadeur, I have a video, it will be somewhere in the tips. So, um, yeah, we're selecting our rig, rigify, I drop it, and yeah, we are good to go. But another one thing that I want to mention that's uh, all about bones, what, what bones we need. And in our case, we don't need this bone, hip bones, because it's... Uh, doesn't work with this. Uh, it's in my opinion, it's easier to skip these bones. Mm, uh, we don't need these bones. We don't need also that bone. This will be our torso bone, our root bone in our case, and we need the bones from uh, torso tweak. These two bones. This. Uh, spine of car 003 and spine of car 002. So we need definitely we need neck, shoulders, and head. Control I to invert selection and hide everything else. So we need torso, FK002, FK003, shoulders, neck, and head. So now we will uh, retargeting to the FK arms and IK legs. Uh, that you understand how it's possible to retarget to IK uh, limbs. So uh, we don't need root. Yeah, anything else? We don't need anything else. By the way, another one important thing that's uh, about uh, about this limp follow. I prefer to work with the limp follow and IKFK, yeah, FK arms, FK arms, yeah. What that mean that you rotate shoulders and arms just follow uh, location, not rotation. And, but it's up to you. Maybe you like otherwise. We will start with foot, left foot. And we need this one, just select here, left foot, this foot right, this one, select here, press eye dropper. Uh, yeah, and in, in that case, we will work with the IK. And to do this, uh, we need to select our foot, in our case, foot left, yeah, this one, foot left, and here, check box IK, and select pole target. How to get this pole target? I hope you know. If you doesn't, Alt F. Uh, I have this 
hidden folder here. Here you have you can select this bone, go to the bone settings and toggle pole on off on off. Yeah, I hope you know now. So uh, let's go further to the Autoric Pro. You select your left uh, left foot IK. After that, select pole target and yeah foot ik left tie ik target l yeah okay so for right the same uh, select your right foot and select select your right foot yeah and after that ik and select your ball target and yeah ball target yeah so that's set up for ik retargeting of for for legs uh, let's go further forearm forearm left uh, forearm left this one uh, forearm right this one hand L this one and R uh, this one forearm hand yeah 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 shin we don't need because we use uh, IK shin shoulder L shoulder L here you are shoulder R here we go Death spine, that will be our torso. Pawn, and uh, yeah, very important to set as a root. That is quite important. Key feature to work with Autoric Pro. Don't forget that the torso, our root, in, a, in that case. Uh, we'll, I skip Death Spine 001, up to you, you can try to play with it, but in my opinion it's better to skip it. Death Spine 02, yes, this one, FK will be, 003 will be this one, and uh, Death Spine 004, it's a neck in Rigify, so select your neck. And we skip Death Spine 005 because it's second bone for the neck, and we don't need this. And yeah, we select Death Spine 004, it will be our head. Tie, we don't need uh, tie, R, R, we don't need, uh, we don't need fingers, toe. Yeah, we need a toe. Uh, left toe, select your left toe. A right toe, select right toe, yeah, upper arm, yeah, upper arm, definitely we need upper arm, left, upper arm, FK, left, and upper arm, FK, right, yep, yep, now, um, by the way, when you done this stuff, you only need to do this only once. After that, you can export this, name it uh, somehow. Uh, Cascador to rigify. And yep. And uh, later, you just can import this from that menu. Oh, no, 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 no just import it from somewhere yeah like here just import it and later it will appear in the menu i guess no no anyway you can just import it whatever so now we are good to go it's look like yeah 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 yeah, yeah so uh build ball list auto scale uh, i do not use it but some in some cases maybe it's uh it will be fine to use this. Let's see what we get so far. Retarget target and frame store uh, of 105, 181. Yeah, probably, yeah. 
uh, linear keyframe handles default yeah whatever uh, that's it okay let's see what we get so far and here we are yeah it's a bit off because I move the root bones in my uh, alt G probably yeah and here we go now we have our animation done as you see it's strange bug with this leg but anyway everything works fine yeah they like pointing on the pole target if you see without layouts yeah everything worked totally fine so you can further adjust this animation and that's how you can bring your cascader animation back to rigify so i hope i answer your question i hope it was useful so see you on the next video guys bye